Hello and welcome to Sound and Melodies. In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly create a template for your Nuendo workflow. First, I'm going to import all the audios that I have. I've already imported the video. So there we go into different tracks and copy all files to project folder. And now we have different tracks and we have a music file. And I'm not sure at the moment what is what, but uh, looks like audio path one and audio path two are separate things. So an audio path one and trailer V3 are the same thing. So I'm going to mute that. And we need to make different groups to route audios into different buses. And finally to submaster bus and then a master bus. Nuendo already created a master bus for us, which I will drag it down here and remove this folder. And in zones, I would like to put this master bus on the right side, which is already there. So that's good for us. Now I'm going to right click on the MX or the music track and add track group channel to selected channels. And this is going to be a master MX bus. And this is uh, going to be outside of the folder. And the audio output right now is going to master. Okay for us. And I'm going to say add track and now we have mx bus and uh, that going to master now we need to move some stuff from here and those are coming from the aaf and let's call it boom track or the production sound we can call it production sound so i'm going to add a track and group channel to selected channel and i'm gonna call it production bus add now that we have two different bus, we can start color coding them. And I would like to color code them in a way that I understand that these are the bus tracks. I can do that. And uh, for the master track, similar, I'd like to keep it red and move the master track up here. And the MX bus and PR bus can now have their own bus group channel to select said channels. And this one we will call submaster. And we, we're going to move the submaster up here and uh, give the same color as the master. Now what is happening is the audios from these different tracks will go to these tracks will go to PR bus production sound bus and audio from music track will go to music bus and the audio from both of them is going to submaster which in turn is going to the master we can quickly check if that's working by pulling out this mixing um, window mix window and as we can see it says master let's zoom it out a little bit and the real audio going to master as well and these two goes to production bus and this is the production bus and mix bus is here where this mix uh, music audio is going and uh, here is the music audio which goes to the music bus and all of them goes to submaster and now i'd like to move the submaster up here so that uh, we are uh, so that we can look how the signal flow is happening and additionally i'd like to move both of these buses here as well or we don't need to move them. We'll just keep them here. Now, I would additionally lock the group channel. These things are not here, so let's add them. Now, what this is going to do is it is going to lock our bus channels so that we don't accidentally go, go here and change things. So I'm going to lock that. I'm going to lock that as well. And finally, the master channel. We're going to lock everything unless we need it. We'll open it and then edit it out and then again lock them. All right, looking quite good. Now I'm going to duplicate this uh, music track without the audio clip there by going to edit and macros and duplicate selected tracks without data. There we go. This will duplicate everything of the track configuration and it will not retain any audio data and now I will move all of them into a folder called MX folder mm. like that and create a certain color for music color coding 
and I will move all the production sounds into another folder and call it PR folder and move all of our stuff up here and call these mm, I don't know it can be this color for now or this color for now yeah and finally what I'm going to do is put this divide track list which will divide the track as it says and I'm going to move some stuff up here for example the marker is already up there and I'm going to move this real audio and real video up here and reduce the size of this real audio and move this whole thing up there and additionally I could move this submaster and master all the way up here so that we're gonna just leave it like that up there or if we need some space we can have it down here one additional stuff that I like about Nuendo is the loudness track so I'm going to put this loudness track up here and maybe have these two down here because I may not need to go and check these tracks again and again while there are will there while there will be more tracks down here and these will get hidden so I'm going to put that up there and we'd need ambience tracks now so I'm going to go down here and uh, hit T on keyboard and we need one stereo ambience track AMB one mm, AMBST let's call it like that and we're gonna need another oh yeah let's call it AMBST again and let's add it already it's going to be a stereo audio track and that will mm -hmm, like that and we will add another by holding T we'll add another mono track here and call it AMBM and let's color code them as green since they are ambience you know and we'll add a group channel to selected channels and call it AMB bus and this is going to be a stereo and we can move can check the color it doesn't show up here it's quite all right we can put the same color down there and give it a folder and call it amb folder and add everything in there and color code that to the amb thingy and likewise we can go on adding more tracks for sound effects sound design and have their own um, buses and ultimately the bus will be routed to submaster like that and the submaster will be routed to master and that is how our project will work everything seems fine for now and this is how we can quickly create a template for our workflow and thank you for watching this video if you have any questions thoughts or comments please put it down below and we'll see you in next video